Hey, brother, can we talk about this uh, the Chamber of Commerce, right? And their position on issue one. Sure. How, like, how, how, how would you explain that? Uh, I would explain it that the Ohio Chamber of Commerce has been for protecting the Constitution for 13 years yeah. that we have documented. So it's been a position we've had for a very, very long time. Uh, I've only been there two years. Uh, there are folks on my board who say that they've been been talking about it for 20 years. So this is our opportunity. We didn't weigh in during the legislative debate, but when it was on the ballot, we chose to take a position consistent with the position we've had for 20 years. But so, it, but you're not you're not doing anything on the abortion issue, right? We are not about social issues. We're about business issues. But there's a lot of reasons to protect the Constitution for business issues as well. But how how is how would being against, like if this passes, I mean, it's clear, we all know it's clear for the abortion, right? So it, it impacts the Constitution, any provision for the Constitution. I would make the argument that somebody could say that, you know, this thing may not pertain to the abortion issue. That would have to be litigated. I'm not a lawyer, but if they change it midway through the process, that thing's been mm -hmm. gathering signatures, been approved by the ballot board for months. That's a little different. It's, it's kind of coincidental, though, that I mean they've wanted this for 20 years. That, you know, the chamber's got a lot of power up here, uh, and it just happens to come to the fruition. We don't control with when it goes on the ballot. We didn't weigh it in the legislative process, but once it's on the ballot, we had to choose to either do nothing or do something, and we chose to be for it. I'm going to. So your, uh, so you, but your your position is it's on the minimum wage, right? Well, on a lot of issues, minimum wage is an example of a business issue. So you, okay, we'll yeah. keep talking again.